Hello, everyone. This week, I have a question for you that I'd like to pose. And it is, are you sharing your wisdom? Are you really making the most of being that grandmother you are? Whether or not you have grandchildren, when we get to a certain age, uh, in some cultures, you are considered a grandmother. You are an elder. Hi, I'm Karen Dorland, owner of Image Connections. And I had the privilege of attending um, a women's summit in uh, Barrie. Actually, it was called One Woman Fearless Summit. And it was put on by Sharla Brown. And I encourage you to visit her website and her Facebook page called One Woman. Anyway, it was a day filled with um, women from all over giving their talk about how they are fearless or have been through many situations. And many of these speakers referred to their grandmothers as being the ones who encouraged them and how much they missed not having them there to continue giving them those words of encouragement. And that really resonated in my heart because I am a grandmother. I'm an elder in our society. And as a grandmother, I feel that it is up to us to speak our, our wisdom and to share it and to be a leader to the younger generation. And I know many of you ladies watching are grandmothers as well. In fact, for me, I feel like I am just starting in life. Inside is very vibrant and I'm still full of creative ideas. And you know, we have experienced many changes and I think it's good to be able to share those and not be afraid to stand up and be relevant in our society. So however um, that looks like to you, instead of retiring back into the background, maybe you are choosing in your retirement to start a new business and be an entrepreneur or maybe it is volunteering in schools to listen to children read or maybe it's being there for your own children and your grandchildren no matter how it shows up i still think it's so important that um that we share our experiences and our wisdom on April 22nd, my friend Patty Martin and I are hosting um, a workshop for the day on third age living because that is where we are at. That is it going into the retirement uh, stage is called third age living. And um, we are talking about the possibilities that are there for people who are thinking about retiring and are a little nervous about it. What will I do and how will that look? You'll find out more information about that on my newsletter and my Facebook page as well. Or you can contact me, Karen at imageconnections.ca. But today was a very, um, it really, as I said, struck a chord in my heart when these women were talking about the impact their grandmothers had on them. And I often feel that in our Western society, being a grandmother may get shoved to the background or we go, oh, I'm a, I'm a grandmother. I don't like being called granny or something like that. Although I know that many of us are just so excited to have grandchildren in our life. However, I think that as an elder, we have a responsibility as well to be role models to, um, to those around us in all that we do. 
I'd love to know how you're showing up as a grandmother and as an elder. I welcome your comments below. I've thoroughly enjoyed reading the comments that uh, have been coming in lately. It really warms my heart. And um, I'm happy to know I'm striking a chord with um, some people and, you know, I am speaking more about um, things that I'm facing now and it's relevant for others out there as well. So I'm Karen Dorland, owner of Image Connections. I love it when you comment and share and like my videos.